college a place where a group of strangers meet and turn out to be a beautiful family at the end it is a time when you start to think about your future and become the creator of your own destiny what better place to do this than this prestigious institution spread over 936 acres of land welcome to iit bhubaneswar Indian Institute of Technology Bhubaneswar is a public institution established in the city of Bhubaneswar Odisha. The birth of this institute came on the 60th anniversary of the country's independence on 15th August 2007 when the Prime Minister of India at that time made the announcement about the expansion of the IIT system across the country. It was formed in the year 2008 among the eight new IITs started by the government of India. Lush green campus spread over 936 acres with historic Baruna Hills as its backdrop. The atmosphere here makes you rely on yourself and keeps you motivated and refreshed. We are now in front of the admin building, which is located at the heart of a campus. It has all the academic offices, from JE office to office of Dean Academics. But you will not be visiting this place just for office work, as it also has a reading room and a central library for students. This is the central library of the IIT Bhubaneswar. With centralized air conditioning, the range and quality of the services offered by the library is comparable to any other modern library in India with international standards. Besides holding an excellent collection of over 22,000 plus volume of books, it also provides access to popular magazines, selected journals, theses, reports, e-books, e-journals, and many more. This is the IIT bridge. It separates the residential area from the academic area. Everything except from well the academics is on the residential area. We have 5 hostels, 3 for boys and 2 for girls. Nice ratio. There are also faculty quarters on the opposite side of boys hostel. In fact, everything is on the opposite side of boys hostel. We have our own world there. Our hostels are named after rivers of India, namely Mahanadi, Brahmaputra, Rushikulya, Ganga, and Subarna Rekha. This is the director's bungalow, and beside that is the guest house. And these are our faculty and staff quarters. We also have a Sangam hostel for married PhD couples. Community center or CC is the place where you will find most of the events of the college. It is a fully AC hall used to host occasion meeting and events from dance drama music you will find them all it is usually going to be the first place where you will be sitting with your friends in the audience enjoying the performances we also have our grand auditorium currently under construction this is sac a student activity center it is the hub of all extracurricular activities the students gymkhana operates from here which comprises of three different councils the tech council the social cultural council and the sports council the sac has a dance room a gym which is divided into two parts one for cardio and the other for weight training it also has an indo court for badminton and table tennis the sac has multiple courts for basketball volleyball and lawn tennis it also has a football ground with a pavilion a hockey ground and a cricket ground Tired of playing? Don't worry. We have a sea right behind the sporting area, where you can get fruits, shakes, or juices, and anything you want. There are two nice cafes in our campus. One is near lecture hall complex. Another one is near girls hostel. Well, no comments on this. It is also a dating spot for the love birds in our campus. Here, you can get hot and cold beverages, sandwiches, burgers, maggi, etc. You can also get chocolate and pizza here. Pizza and milkshake. Till I go up to the end. Oh, sorry. We'll have to go to the rolling crunches for pizza. The food truck visits campus from 3 till 11 in the night, where you can get all type of food and drinks, from mojito, Oreo shakes to pizza, burger, and fries. Arey, arey, kya ho gaya? Arey, koi ambulance bana ho. Bravo. In case you fall sick of it, you won't see the full lights. We have a medical unit but I can help you with all the basic facilities and doctors available 24/7.
that was all from the residential area. Now let's visit the part in which your parents are more interested. Yes, the academics part. The academic area is a fully green region with peripheral peak plantation of 21 km filled with orchids of fruits and medicinal tree varieties. We have seven different schools in the campus. They are the School of Electrical Sciences which houses three departments, Computer Science Engineering, Electronic and Communication Engineering and Electrical Engineering, School of Basic Sciences which houses Physics, Chemistry and Mathematics departments. School of Mechanical Sciences. It also has a lab which consists of many machines which will be introduced in the introduction of manufacturing processes. School of Infrastructure which houses the Civil Department. SMME or School of Mineral, Metallurgy and Material Engineering. School of Earth, Ocean and Climate Sciences. School of Humanity, Social Sciences and Management. LBC or Lecture Block Complex is for the first year students with centralized air conditioned classrooms and labs. Campus life is not just about academics, it's much more than that. And IIT Bhuvneshwar will let you experience it throughout the year. IIT Bhuvneshwar has a very rich culture of celebrating festivals be it Holi, Diwali, Dashera, or Ganesh Otsav. We celebrate them all. The experience you get here will make you stop ceasing from exploration. So come here and live a life you will never forget.